Good evening. Hello, Lorena. Hello. Hello, hello, Helen. Helen, good evening. Hi, good evening. Okay, Jacqueline. Hello. Good evening. Hello, hello. Good evening. Good evening. Hello, good Karen. evening, teacher. And we have Catherine over here. Now we have two, four, five, six people, I think. And we still waiting for the rest. Well, we're going to start, you know, for me, it's quite important to take advantage of time. And as you know, the, the question that I usually ask is, hey, what's new in English, Lorena? I, I have learned that then asking a question in English, you doing on I I not 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 I also practice the present and future when asking and asking a question. Fantastic. Okay. Do, do you have some? Some examples, Lorena? Uh, for example, present, present continuous. Um, what, what are you doing? Uh, what are you, you doing tomorrow? Um, Well, Only that. Okay, thank you. Jacqueline, what's new in English? Jacqueline Hernandez, good evening. Hello. Hello. What's new in English? Hey, I practice. Today, I practice on the city of Los Angeles, climate September, October, and November. Hello. One, very for months of the year. However, it is important to note that there can be in temperature during the day or night, especially near the coast. When visiting Los Angeles, it is advisable to wear comfortable like clothing such as a sheer blue stuff and a short light color ideal for reflexing health and keeping cool. And keeping cool, all right, ideal, right? Okay, thank you, Jacqueline. Thanks for sharing the info. Irma, good evening. Yuli, Yuli you hear me? Yeah, can you can, hear me? We can do it. Okay. Um, okay, um, I have been practicing uh, the the working parts. I I I think that uh, that bird is very dif difficult difficult. So you've been Example, practicing birds. Sí, um, began, ben, bet, bon, bled, eh, eh, broke, broke, um, burst, um, well, that's, that's fantastic. I really, um, 
congratulate you because you know learning English daily it's very important because we have a lot of verbs and a good um I mean to start uh, learning a little bit more it's important to uh, acquire a lot of verbs in English. Rebecca, good evening. Thank you, thank you, Dalila. Hello, what's in English, please? You're welcome. What's new in English, uh, Rebecca? Pero me puede repetir? Uh, what did you learn today in English? Oh. Ay, lo siento, teacher, estoy que no puedo ni hablar de la ah. tos. Uh, uh, okay, don't worry, Rebecca. <laughs> Later on, you will participate. Let us listen to, to Kenya. Kenya, what's new in English, Kenya? Hi, good, uh, good night, teacher. Hello, good evening. Uh, uh, what I have learning this day is that how to practice my, my pronunciation a lot. Okay. Me cuesta un poquito. Tengo que estar practicando bastante, entonces eso es lo que, lo que he aprendido. Tengo que estarlo practicando mucho. Okay, that's the way it is, right? Like to be like practicing continuously okay yes. so let me see well we are still missing like 10 10 minutes more and then we're gonna see the homework assignment mm, Jose Angel okay Angel I got your message let us listen to um to Griselda hello Griselda good evening Good evening, teacher. Este, yo pues he estado practicando prácticamente mi nombre de letreado y a la vez eh, el número para la actividad de mañana. Ah, okay, the activity you're preparing for tomorrow. And also, yes. well, today remember that you you're going to um perform a conversation in pairs, right? That's a homework. But, well, let us listen to Juan Antonio. Sí, usa, uh, perdón, perdón, uh, teacher. Griselda. Este, yo tenía como una duda. Este, por ejemplo, eh, yo tenía pensado decir, como se dice, una conversación. Entonces, pero también quería como decir el que he aprendido a, valga la redundancia, decir mi número de teléfono. Entonces, no sé si es conveniente decirlo por número, es decir, 77, o por dos números, es decir, como empieza 77, 177, 181, 15A, o también se puede de la otra forma, 77, 81, 5A, 03. So, but in both ways, Priscilla, both ways are okay. Both. Okay? Okay, teacher. Gracias. Oh, okay. <clears throat> now, Juan Antonio, I can, I can notice that you want to participate tonight. Uh, good evening, teacher. Good evening. I, um, today I learned a new phrase and I'm born to make be happy I was born to be happy oh, yes teacher okay it's a phrase new new phrase okay thank you thank you now Henry Vladimir good evening Hello, Henry. Good evening, good evening. Henry, can you listen to me?
Mm, well, I can notice that uh, he is facing some technical problems. So, well, we are going to start, okay, with the class. And later, you will have the opportunity to present the conversation. Uh, you, you created or the conversation you investigated in a web. Well, in the platform, we're going to encounter the, the, the topic we're in church of tonight. Yesterday, we studied about present continuous double H questions. And tonight, oh, Well, we're gonna see this video, okay? Because we didn't we didn't see the full the full uh, information. We're gonna see it, and then um, we're going to solve some some examples, some exercises, and at the end, well, you will have the opportunity to work in pairs to create the conversation by using double H questions in present continuous. Pay attention. Let's listen and practice. Hi, Mom. What are you doing, Steve? I'm cooking. Why are you cooking now? It's two o'clock in the morning. Well, I'm really hungry. What are you making? Pizza. Mmm, pizza. Now I'm getting hungry. Let's eat. Now, let's try to make sense of present continuous WH questions. We will typically use present continuous WH questions whenever we want to get information from an action that is in progress. For example, what are you doing right now? To form WH questions, we need to follow this formula. WH word plus verb to be plus subject plus the verb plus ing plus some kind of complement. If we look at the images on the screen, you can see a few WH questions. Let's analyze the first one. What's Victoria doing? We have a WH word, what. Then we have the verb to be, is. After that, we have the subject, Victoria. After that, we have the uh, verb in its ing form. And then we have a question mark. Then, of course, you can see the question being answered. She's sleeping now. Now, we're going to listen to the rest of the questions and answers. Let's listen and repeat. Los Angeles, 4 a.m. What's Victoria doing? She's sleeping right now. Mexico City, 6 a.m. 6 a.m. What's Marcos doing? It's 6 a.m., so he's getting up. New York City, 7 a.m. What are Sue and Tom doing? They're having breakfast. Brasilia, 9 a.m. What's Celia doing? She's going to work. London, 12 noon. What are James and Anne doing? It's noon, so they're having lunch. Moscow, 3 p.m. What's Andre doing? He's working. Bangkok, 7 p.m. What's Permsak doing? He's eating dinner right now. Tokyo, 9 p.m. What's Hiroshi doing? He's watching television. Your city. What are you doing? It's. So I'm. The last thing that I would like for you to do is to look at the images again and write questions and answers about them. For example, what's Celia wearing? Celia's wearing a red suit. After you complete this assignment, please share your work in our discussion forums. Okay, so the information was displayed. 
And as you could notice, it's information we started yesterday. That's why we're gonna we're not gonna spend a lot of time in in, in noticing about the information the guy is has just presented, but well, I think the most important part of the videos for for starting with the activity is this, right? Like the conversation. Now, as you can see, we have double H question over here. And then we have ING form. And the same happens with this one, right? So why are you cooking now? And, and I think those are the only two, two, two words, I mean, two questions that we use in this conversation. Now, Well, there are some people here. I think it's better if we if we see it in a in a different. Okay, Glenda, I got your message. Okay, notice about the people in the image, right? So we have LA, Celia. What time is it in LA, people? 4 a.m. It's 4 a.m., right? Four in the morning. What about James and Nan? No, this is only, yeah, James. No, let me see. That's Marcos, right? I think it's Marcos. Marcos, that's right. So the first one was Victoria. The second one's Marcos. Okay, so Marcos and Jane. Hey, what's Marcos doing? Uh, he's, uh, wake up. He's getting up. Okay, what time is it in Mexico now? Oh, what time is it in Mexico? 6 a.m. 6 a.m. 6 o'clock. 6 a.m. 6 a.m. And now we have the big apple. You know the big apple, right? New York is, is named like the big apple. Now, what time is it in the in New York City? Oh, it's 7 a.m. 7 a.m. What are they doing? Uh, Breakfast. Breakfast. They yeah, are but breakfast. They, they are having breakfast, or they are eating uh, breakfast, and they are also talking. What else? They having a break. They are having dinner at, at the moment. That's the information about Sue and Tom. Now, then we have Brasilia. What time is it in Brasilia, people? <laughs> What time is it there? Nine o'clock. It's nine o'clock. Nine o'clock. James and Nan. It is nine a.m. Yeah, I mean, you, you, uh, Celia is the one, right? I think Celia. No, but James and Anne. What time is it in London? Well, it's 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 12 Working. He's working. He's, working. He's, he's reading. He's working. He he's is. reading. Okay. Pretty good. So now. We already <clears throat> talked about Victoria, Marcos, Sue and, and Tom, Celia, Jameson, and, and Anne. And now let's see the information about Andre. What time is it in Moscow? 3 p.m. 3 p.m. It's 3 p.m. What's Andre doing? Uh, 
working. He's working. He's working hard. He's reading. Okay. Now, let's get back. And we have the following statement. Hey, um, what is Marcos uh, wearing, people? What's Marcos wearing? Pijama. Uh, is he wearing pajamas? He's wearing pajamas. Marcos wearing pajamas. So the second one. Now, the second one? He's wearing pajamas. He is? I think this is the best option, right? He's wearing pajamas. Okay, the next one, number two. What's Celia wearing? He's wearing He's wearing. A suit. She's wearing a suit. A suit. He's wearing a suit. Number five. Why are James and Nan having lunch? I have lunch because it's Nan. James and Ann are have James and Ann are, are having, having are having lunch are having lunch because it's noon because it's noon good and the last one number six when's when's Andre working oh he's where's working. Andre working he's working in Moscow he's working in Moscow okay very good Moscow Okay, Jose, I got it. Don't worry. And well, just to finish with the first part of the class, we're gonna listen to to this audio. And as you can see over here, we have uh positive statements, negative statements, double H questions, or just not questions in English. And we have a, a conversation between Oliver and I think it's Alfie. Alfie. And let us see what's coming now. Pay attention, people. Hey, listen and read. Hey Alfie, what are you doing? I'm... Ah, here we go. Hey Alfie, what are you doing? I'm studying for tomorrow's exam. You? Yeah, me too. Well, I'm just uploading some photos to Facebook and I'm sending a message to Billy. Oh, and I'm downloading the new Arcade Fire album. Oh yeah, and I'm having a coffee too. It's tiring all this studying. Oh, and at eight, I'm meeting Lucas just for a quick coffee. It's important to take regular breaks, you know. You're not really studying at all, are you? Come on, mate. If you don't pass the exam, you'll have to take it again after the holidays. You sound like my mum, Alfie. Talk of the devil. She's calling me. I think South is the one. I'll phone you later, OK? Sure. Hi, mum. Hello, love. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm studying, mum. I've got a big exam tomorrow. What about you? Oh, Ollie, I just had to phone you. I'm riding a camel at the pyramids. Cool. I'm with a tour group. We're having a great time. We're all riding camels and the sun's shining. Oh, it's fantastic, Ollie. Lucky you. So, are you working hard for the exam? I'm trying to, Mum. What's Daisy doing now? Is she at home? No, she's at tennis practice. 
Oh, of course she is. <clears throat> OK, I've got to go. They're waiting for me to get off the phone. Bye, love. Bye, Mum. <laughs> It's a bad, la, bad mom. Okay, so this is an example only. Remember, you are going to have some time to practice the conversation. You investigate it. I will create the groups now. And after those 15 or 10 minutes, we are going to start with the, with the conversations, okay? Now, let me see how many people do I have tonight. Well, 17. So we're going to work in purse. Henry, any question? Good evening, teacher. Hello. Yo quería participar porque tendría que me preguntó, no, no le puedo contestar. Tenía problemas con el micrófono. Ok, Henry, go ahead. He was looking at how to force sentence with irregular verb. The for the simplest pass of irregular verb, she put the subject, the verb, in the simple pass, and the necessary complement, for example. I ate chocolate yesterday. Otro ejemplo sería, they weren't in Rio last summer. Okay. Thank you, Henry. Now, thank you very much. I, I really appreciate it. Now, we're going to work in, in I, I, I think it is better if we create like groups, okay? Three people in a group. So that's the way we're gonna we're gonna work tonight. And I will give you like five, ten, like fifteen. I think with ten minutes will be enough for you to get into an agreement and practice the conversation I told you yesterday. Here we go. Okay.
¿Quién me ayuda aquí? Eh, creo que... Siquiera com... Creo que iba a comenzar, va. No dijo cuánto tiempo nos iba a dar. No, voy a dejar de compartir para ver. No, pues seguimos. Perdón, voy a volver a compartir rápido. Vale, ok. Vaya, ahí estamos, ¿verdad? Sí. Ok. Entonces empieza okay. usted, o quien que me quiera ayudar, con yo. Alice. Si quiere yo. Ajá. Sí, yes, ok. Vaya. Uh, uh -huh. Sería. Hi, Bo, what are you doing? I'm studying for the match test tomorrow. How about you? I watching a movie on Netflix. This, this is very interesting. 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 <laughs> what movie are you watching? I watching the Matrix. How do you say it? Seen it. La la es como y creo. Seen it. Seen it. Have you seen it? No. No, I haven't. What is it about? About. It's about uh, computers. Computer. Hacker, computer. Hacker um, to discover that the that the world is a simulation. Simulation. Controlled by 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 machines. Machines. He joins a group of rebel to feed. Who? El WH creo que es who. Oh, who, who fights? Who fight against the machine? Machines. Mm -hmm. Como, ma como machitos, pero machines. <ríe> Yo así lo he escuchado en la serie. Qué barbaridad. Ay, no. ¿Qué tal? Hola. Hola. Hello, Pedro. Any problem? <laughs> yes, teacher, que como no, no, no hay nadie para platicar. What about Glenda and what about Carla? No está, no está, no sé. No contesta. No hablan, estoy sola prácticamente. No, but I think Carla is, is talking now. Carla, hello. Hello, Welcome. me escuchan. Yes, Hola. Hola. Ah, yes. Estaba arruinando el audio que no me funcionaba. Ok, Pero Carla. Sí. Carla, no rem remember that you are in church of uh, working in a conversation now. And actually you are missing like five minutes more, no more than that. Ok. Ok. ¿De qué podemos hablar? ¿Del clima? Sí, del clima. ¿De, ¿De otro Está... país o de acá? No sé. Um, a ver. Creo 
Hello, people. Are you ready? Rebecca, Henry, eh, Juan Antonio. Good evening, teacher. Are, are you ready with the conversation? Good evening. Este, creo que no, porque siento que nos ha costado un poquito porque creo de que lo habíamos hecho como en parejas. Entonces, estamos tratando de hacer una que incluya los cuatro para que ninguno quede fuera. Okay. Okay, so you have you have five minutes more, okay? okay. Teacher. Hello, Vladimir. Este, yo estoy modificando una ahorita ya la voy a compartir leyendo. Okay, it's because Henry, you know, take advantage of time. You only have five minutes. Bueno. Okay. Right now. Es, es right, right now, now de, de ahora, right now. Ahora, uh -huh. right now. Es N O W. Sí. Ah, pues es, sí. es right now. Right now. Right oh, now. 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 Sí, es que la W hace eso del now. Right now. Así, now. Ajá. Hi, Jacqueline. Okay. I watching a movie on Netflix. Permítame que se me apagó la pantalla. Uh, what what uh, movie are you watching? I'm watching Tiger Train. Stranger It's Things. Really good. It's tranqui. Es, eh, son cosas extrañas. Entonces, de Stranger Things. Stranger, Stranger Things. Stranger Things, ajá. Stranger la, las, que, las palabras que nos cuesta son las que son bien <risa> largas y, y a veces uno no acostumbra. <risa> Stranger Things. Stranger sí. Things, no. No, no han visto esa serie. Yo tampoco, pero sí le iba a mencionar. Por eso es que me sé el nombre. Yo no sé. Si es serie, no. No me gusta la serie. Ah, bueno, yo, yo no la he visto, pero sí he ido a mencionarla. Por eso es que sé cómo se escucha. Ah, ok. Strange. <risa> Strange Thing. Strange. También eh, Stranger. Stranger. Stranger, perdón. Stranger Thing. T-H-I-N-G. Thing. Creo Ting. que esa es cosa. Ajá, cosas extrañas. Stranger Thing, ¿sí? Bueno, vuelvo a decir la oración really vuelvo a decir la oración completa con, con eso que es lo que completa vale a ver si la entendí <ríe> bueno I watching Stranger Things it's really good how you see it have is have you see it que está bien how you see it? have you see it uh -huh. así ah ok how you see it ajá uh -huh. ok uh -huh. ¿La has visto? Eso que significa. ¿La has visto? ¿Has you seen? ¿Has you seen? Un minuto tenemos. Sigan, muchachas. Ok. ¿Usted ya qué? Yeah, I... Yeah, I've seen 
is before I actually working on a project for a school right now. now. Right now. Right now. Now, ¿verdad? Now, ¿sí? Now. now. Mm -hmm. What song is interesting? What their project about? It's it's about climate climate change and the impact it has on our planet. I am doing some research and writing a paper on it. Paper. Paper. I hope that you practice a lot and so that you can uh, share the conversation with the group. So we're going to start as quickly as possible. I have the groups all in here. And for example, let me see. Group number one. Uh, I have Jacqueline, Jose, Angel, and Kenya. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Eh, si gusta, me ayuda Kenia. La, la... Solo voy a compartir mi, mi documento de... Es este. Eh, ahí está. Si gusta, empieza Kenia. Ok. Hi, boss. What are you doing? Espérame, es que me está tapando el, el, regale un momento, es que me está tapando la, lo, sí. con... discúlpeme, teacher, I'm sorry. Don't worry, ahí está, Angel. ahí está, ahí está. Eh, si gusta, Kenia, por favor. Okay. Hi, boss, what are you doing? I'm studying for the math test tomorrow. How, how about you? Um, watching um movies on the Netflix. This is very interesting. What movie are you watching? Um, uh, watching. Um, uh, watching the Matrix. Have you seen it? No, I haven't. What is about? It's about a uh, computer. Hacker will discover uh, that the world is a simulation controlled by machines. I hope a joins a group of relic in world first against the machine. Wow, that sound is sex exciting. Maybe I'll watch it later. You saw it a cloud. Well, it it they do a studio good lunch with the with the test. Thanks, Alice. Enjoy the movie. Bye. Bye. All right. Okay. Now remember about the importance of uh pronunciation. Okay, but. Well, I can notice that you practiced a lot and that you were like uh, doing your, your best. And well, you did it quite well. Ahora sería con, con Jacqueline, ¿verdad? Sí. Okay, go ahead, Kenya. Kenya and Jacqueline. Sí. Hey, Kenya. What what are you doing right now? Hi Jacqueline, I watching a movie on Netflix. What what movie are are you watching? I watching a uh, studying thing is really good. How do you see it? Yeah, I have seen it before. I I am actually working. 
on a project for rescue right now. Now that song that song interesting was the project about. It's about climate change and the impact it has on our planet. I am doing some research and writing a paper on it. Wow, that sounds like uh, a lot of world good look with that. Thank you. I am hoping, hoping to finish it soon so, soon so I can relax and watch some Netflix to finish. Okay, thank you very much. Now, listen, I, I was just telling you about the different about sun and sound. Okay, remember about it. Sun, sound. Sun, sound. Thank you very much. Now, we're going to listen to the group number two. Glenda, Karel, and Carla. Go ahead, because we still have like seven minutes more. Hi, Carla. No, Carla? Yeah, Carla is there. Hi, Carla. Hi, Carla. Hi, Karen. What are you doing, Carla? Uh, sorry? What are you doing? Oh. Uh, in this moment, uh, I am uh, in class in uh, the English. Uh, I I I sit in my in my table in, in from a computer. Wow, it's awesome. Well, I in this moment. Also in class, the 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 oh. where are you living? I I live in Toronto, Canada. Well, yeah. is it snowing or cold? Or sunny. Uh, yes, uh, it is snowing uh, because the the Christmas uh, session uh, is it very snowing. What 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 do you close wearing? today uh, I were in bot uh, gloves and in quad uh, because uh, in the wearing it's very cool. Very cool. Sorry. Okay. I'm here. I'm here. It's raining. It's <laughs> very cold. Them. And I am in. I am wearing coat and boots. Also. And the scarf and the coat. Oh, cool. Um, when when time is it in this moment? Um, 
What time is it in this moment? Right, right now it's five, uh, five, no, eight, eight or five p.m. And what about you here? Okay. What time is it? Uh, here, uh, it's 11 past, uh, 11, uh, past 20. Okay, great. This is, this is all teacher. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, uh, I included two words in the chat like boat and boot. Okay, boots, boots, boat, boat, boots. Okay, let me see okay. the, the following group. I think we still have like some minutes and then we're gonna try to finish with the session tonight. <clears throat> this is group, this was group number two, right, Cario? So group yes. number three, Irma, Karen, and Lorena. Okay. Okay. Ready, girls? Hello. Yes. Okay. Start. Hi. Hi. What's your name? My name is Karen. Hi, Karen. My name is Irma. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. What are you doing here? I'm going to my sister. Is she the one buying, buying a soda? No, she's not. She's over there. Oh, great. Hi, Lorena. Hi, Lorena. Hi. What are you buying? I buying. I do it because today is my birthday. Oh, happy birthday, Lorde. Thanks. I'm sorry, but we have to be calm. Yes. Okay. Bye, Irma. Bye, girls. That's it, teacher. Thank you very much. Thank you, Karen, Irma, and Lorena, right? So, yeah. Okay, so we're going to stop by here. I need to provide some feedback about what you did tonight. And uh, remember, tomorrow we have two special activities. Can somebody mention about the activities we're, we're seeing tomorrow? Do you remember about the activities we have for tomorrow, people? Do you? Yes, teacher. Yeah, which are the activities, Carol? Un resumen de lo que básicamente hemos aprendido durante el curso. Puede ser, puede ser individual o individual. Okay. Sí, verdad. Yeah, that's the first activity, right? To present an activity, I mean, to present uh, something that you have created in order to uh, show everybody uh, how much you have learned in the course. Okay, so give me a second. Okay, we wanna try to finish in a moment. Okay, so and the next activity for tomorrow is the final test, okay? You had the final test. Give me a second, okay. <laughs> okay, I don't know if you have any question, any doubt, any comment. If if you don't, if you don't, we're gonna stop over here. Nos vamos a quedar acá y nos vemos el día de mañana. Okay. Ah, uh, let me see. Okay, Juan, Juan Antonio, I don't know if you want to participate. No. Okay, so we're gonna stop over here, people. Sí. Uh -huh. sí Juan Antonio. Una 
consulta técnica. Yo o mismo. sea, vi que toda la participación estuvo excelente, pero quiero saber cómo se pusieron de acuerdo para, para trabajar de esa manera. Porque no vi nada en el grupo, ni en el chat, ni nada. O sea, ¿cómo trabajaron eso? Porque yo no, no logré. De hecho, aquí vi que Henry Vladimir estaba poniendo, o sea, como ayudándonos para que pudiéramos participar todos. Pero, o sea, fue aquí en el instante, pues. ¿Cómo lo lograron? Eso quiero saber. En el caso de mi grupo, este, los tres teníamos ya hechos nuestros y, y solo los compartimos y los practicamos a lo que eso pudimos, fue, ¿verdad? Eso en fue en privado. El teacher hizo unos grupos privados de tres. Como la actividad ah. pasada que hicimos. Uh, so, remember, eso, Juan, eso bueno, y alguna, algunos... No? As you remember, Juan Antonio, algunos, yesterday I, I asked y algunos to que no teníamos diálogo, pues improvisamos, porque en mi grupo improvisamos. Ah, eso sí, o sea, sí, digamos, bueno, de hecho yo tenía mi conversación, pero como con nadie la compartí, o sea, no tuve con mi dúo, ¿me entiende? No porque sí tenía la conversación. Okay, don't worry, Juan Antonio, because, you know, tomorrow we will continue with the activities, right? So if you want to share the conversation with the group, you can do it, okay? Don't worry. And continue practicing because tomorrow okay. we, we will have lots of activities again. So hopefully you have already finished with the final test. And tomorrow we can have, so that we, tomorrow we can have a review about it. So we're going to stop going here. Uh, people, it's been a pleasure to see you tonight, and I hope to see you tomorrow. Okay, good night. Thank you. See you. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night, everybody. Good night. See you tomorrow. No, that one. No,